They are threatened in North America and can reach up to two feet in length. It's a giant salamander and it could be found in parts of the Tennessee Valley. Meteorologist Brittany Baggs explains how this amphibian gives insight to pollution in our rivers. One of the best locations to see the largest salamander in North America is called a hellbender and you can see it in the Tennessee Valley area along the Hawassi River. It's not the friendliest looking creature, but it won't harm you. If you ever see one in our rivers, it's a good thing. One of those things where you see it and you go, you know, because it is this huge, creepy thing. The hellbender can reach four pounds. It's super sensitive because they breathe out of their skin. Herbicides, silk, and dirt make it hard for them to breathe. So where there is a hellbender, it's a good indicator of clean water. They used to be very common in two thirds of the rivers and creeks in Tennessee. And they, in the past 20 years, they've all uh, they've died back a whole lot. And the Hiawassee River, because of how clean it is, is one of the last you know, refuges of their population. Once common along the Buffalo River, the decay of hemlock trees over the last 10 years has contaminated waterways. There are only hundreds left in the Hiawassee, leaving Angelo Giansante and other park rangers to educate the public in an effort to keep the waters clean and welcoming to this giant salamander. If you plan on camping in the coming weeks, they want folks to remember to clean up styrofoam coolers and make sure to not litter on the campgrounds.